Hey there, Cultivator. Welcome back to my channel and Happy New Year. Ah, I am so excited that it is 2021. I feel like we just turned a new leaf, new year, new opportunities, new start, new beginnings. Can I get an amen? <laughs> I know a lot of us are over with 2020 and especially for job seeking. I mean, job searchers, you guys really felt it last year. I know job searching already is challenging in so many ways, let alone adding on unemployment, let alone adding on industries, having to completely shift and pivot. Oh my goodness, I am just really feeling for you all. So I thought, what better video to create to kick off this new year than walking you through a very step-by-step -step process of the seven C's that you must master and follow in order to land a job in 2021. Because let's be real, applying online, updating and tweaking and customizing your cover letter really doesn't move the needle. What we really need to do is get visible and stand out in the pile of resumes and I'm going to walk you through the exact process that I take all of my clients through. And by the way, these clients landed jobs in 2020. They made complete industry shifts. They made complete pivots in roles and career advancements. So I know it works and I'm going to be breaking it down in this video. By the way, if you by chance are watching this in January 2021, then check out the description box down below because I'm going to invite you in for our free training series. I host this annual and it is such a great week to just not only walk away with the insights and the inspiration and the advice that I'm talking about in this video, but we're actually going to break it down into actionable, implementable steps so that you can chisel away in the right momentum and the right direction to land your dream job a lot quicker and a lot easier. So register down below if you haven't already, and let's dig into the seven C's that you must follow to master the job search. is to claim your confidence. I've seen so many job seekers hold themselves back from even applying to jobs because they felt like it was out of their reach. If you're not confident that you're worthy or capable of a job, then you gotta start addressing the self-doubt. Mindset is one of my favorite areas to address when working with my clients because between all of the rejections, the silences, and going after something new, you're going to find yourself challenged as you continuously step out of your comfort zone. So building unshakable confidence is the foundation of your job search success. Now, the second C is clarifying your calling. You only have one LinkedIn profile or narrative, so it's important that you get clear on what you want. If you're wishy-washy or you haven't committed to a direction, well, how do you expect your employer to select or commit to you? You're going to have multiple careers throughout your lifetime, so trust that this next step that you're interested in is going to help you bridge your greater goals in the future, even if it might seem wildly disconnected right now. Now, once you have a clear plan A, this is when it's time to move on to the third C, which is crafting a compelling career story. So stories inspire and connect people. Listing off a bunch of random titles and your chronological work history, don't. <laughs> so take some time to connect your dots and highlight where you've been and where you're going. When you do this correctly, any career pivot into a new industry or a new function is possible. So next up, it's time to create your personal brand. Now it's time to shine. With your clear goal in mind, you can update your LinkedIn and your resume to position yourself as what you want to be known as. This requires identifying what your future employer cares most about and then doing the legwork of connecting the dots on how your past experience is applicable or transferable. When you have a professional personal brand all polished and ready to go, then and only then is when you can feel confident in the next C, which is connecting with your dream network. Many opportunities are filled before they're ever posted. So just by becoming visible and networking is a huge step. This is where you become a proactive candidate and start to introduce yourself to your future recruiters and hiring managers so that you can start to build relationships for positions now or in the future. When you become visible, then you'll inevitably get invited into interviews. So it's time to crush your interviews. If you feel nervous or you want to be more confident, the good news is 80% of the questions are predictable. By preparing and using psychology tips, you can align yourself as the best candidate and secure an offer. 
And the final C is to command your worth. So even in a down economy, if you get an offer, you can negotiate your worth. At this stage, if you're extended an offer, a company wants you and they've determined that you're the best candidate for them. By the way, if they're hiring, they have a budget. <laughs> so in this case, you wanna take the lead and really negotiate all of the monetary and non-monetary rewards that are going to get you excited to wake up happy on Mondays over and over again. So to recap, the seven must follow steps are claiming your confidence, clarifying your calling, crafting your career story, creating your personal brand, which is LinkedIn and resume, connecting with your dream employers, crushing your interviews, and commanding your worth. Comment down below and let me know if you feel stuck on any of these steps. And if you do, be sure to check out the resource library down below, as well as the seven day training series. It's free by the way. So I hope that you can join us and invite any of your friends that you want to crush your goals with this year. Maybe you have land your dream job in 2021 on your goals list. This is the perfect opportunity. And as always, if you can share, comment, like, subscribe, and hit the bell to be notified, I'm actually releasing this video next week. And until then, I hope you continue to cultivate your life and your career.